allow me to read it. 2K Sports here to present you the NBA Eastern Conference Semifinals. It's Game 4, and one that could go down in the books. Kevin Harlan along with Steve Kerr and Clark Kellogg. Glad you can join us. It's the Miami Heat and the Philadelphia 76ers. The starting five. This is our lineup brought to you by State Farm. One of the guys we're watching out for today, Andrew Bynum. And Bynum is one of the best centers in the league. His size is really a, an amazing advantage. He's so big, so long, and he's able to out-muscle people and just shoot right over the top of his opponents. And Steve, we know that size alone does not make you a great big man, but it certainly helps if you've got some skills. And he's really shown a desire, even though in fits and starts, to be special. More and more aggressive on offense, and because of that, he's tough to handle on the block. We're going to look at Philadelphia. Scratching out a home win tonight will be absolutely critical for them, trailing two games to one in the series. Yeah, and the goal now is just win this game and make it a best of three series and gain the momentum back for yourself. They already know they'll need to win at least one more game on the road, which is going to be tough enough. Uh, so win tonight, make your job a little bit easier. Steve, it definitely would be a long shot. I mean, the stakes really could not be higher for them. We'll see how that pressure affects them. Holiday. Holiday off a bit from Biden. Down to five on the shot clock. Here the step back. He is hauled in by LeBron. He'd have gone one of three for the field to start this one so far. Here's Wayne, and he pings it home with one hand. You know, if he's got the ball in his hands and the basket in his sights, he's going straight to the right. All right, let's go over to the sideline with Doris Burke. Yes, Kevin. Well, Doug Collins and I had a few minutes to catch up. As for the mood of the team coming into this crucial game, he said they're loose, but not so loose that they don't know how important this game is to us. He predicted this would be a statement game for them. Let's see what kind of statement they deliver, gentlemen. Thanks, Doris. Back to Harrington. He kicks to LeBron. Over by him. And LeBron gets it to go with the assist by Harrington. LeBron's now got his first bucket of the night. And Holiday kicks to Turner. Wright sets a screen for Turner. Feeds it to Young. The 76ers need to get off a shot. Another miss by Philadelphia. And that's just one of their first four field goals to begin this game. Into Harrington. That's good. That's the way to work the ball in close to the hoop, guys. And just under two and a half minutes elapsed here in the first. Outside Holiday. Right to end the run. Offensive rebound. A strong effort on the rebound. That's their second chance points. He was not to be denied that time, guys. Fought his way to the glass and came up with the points. LeBron outside. And the shot is good. LeBron's now got his second bucket tonight. And you can just see what his offense means to this team. I mean, it's obvious. They really rely on him to score the basketball. Wade against Holiday. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. Well, at least the defender got his money's worth on that one. Yep, that was an easy whistle for the official. The 76ers have shot just one free throw early. One for one in the game. And here are the Heat now. It's a three-point game. The dish to Harrington. Some nice ball movement here by the Heat. Turner with the steal. Holiday with it. Wade picks him up. Wade against Holiday. Dishes it to Turner. Lets it fly. Snatched up. Bynum shakes off the strong D and gets to the bucket for two. Well, not only does he excel in getting those offensive rebounds, but he's really good getting putbacks and layups off of those boards. He'd have gone five or seven today so far. Nice shooting to get this game underway. Here's Allen. And that one's drained from the low block. Allen's got his first points in this one. 
And Holiday gets to right. Bynum with a screen on Allen. Right dishes to Holiday. It's stolen by Wade. Makes the lead pass. The feed to LeBron. Hammers it home. Throwing it down with one hand and making it look easy. Easy and fun. He just thrives on making the D look silly. Yeah, which is something he does pretty often, Kevin. Now here is Holiday. Right now averaging 15 points a game. And Wright gets to Holiday. He dishes it to Young. Herring's it on him. The pass to Turner. Shot clock at six. Over Allen. Shot's good by Turner. Here's Wade. Averaging 23 points per contest. Here's Clutch. Takes it to Harrington. Here's Clutch. And he feeds it to Wade. Oh, wow. 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 You know, Kevin, that's just him doing his thing. I mean... That's who he is, launching himself at the basket. I mean, he thrust himself at the basket. He's an angry driver and attacker of the rim. That was a great angle we just saw, courtesy of Sprite. And Wright kicks the Bynum. Holiday, Holiday off a pick from Turner. Outside Holiday, Bynum with a screen on Wade. Fires from 14. Here's Wright. And he drops it in following the offensive rebound. Wright's got five minutes. The Heat with the lead. LeBron drives in. Here's Clutch. Yes, and it's LeBron picking up the assist. And all ten of their last points have come inside the paint, so defensively you've got to make an adjustment. Yeah, and you got to do a little more to stop it, too. I mean, it's coming way too easy for them. At some points, you just got to buck up and say it's not going to happen. Here's Young. The Heat getting the bucket. Shot's good by Turner. Uh, if he gets a glimpse of an opening, he's going to take it right to the rim. And it's the Heat with the ball. And it's Wade penetrating. And that one's good. Eight points for him. The 76ers trail by four. Wright says a screen for Holiday. Bynum inside. It's good. The assist that time from Holiday. Bynum's got five. Both sides really coming out of the gate firing here. Guys, they look like they were raring to go in this one. A lot of offense early on. Pass to Wade. Pass to Harrington. Here's Clutch. Lock at six. It's hauled in by the 76ers. They lost their last game on Tuesday. And guys, had their free throw shooting been anywhere near up to par, I think it would have changed everything in that game. No doubt about it. I mean, there is a carryover effect when you're not having success at the line. It infiltrates other parts of your game. Now here's Turner, averaging 13 points a contest. The score now all even. And it's seven points for Bynum. He's feeling it here to start the game. That's three out of four already. Here's Clutch. Back to Wade. Out of bounds. Philadelphia takes possession. What are you doing? Such a careless pass. You've got to keep your head in the... with it. He kicks it to Holiday. Outside Brown. And Turner kicks to Holiday. Some nice ball movement here by the 76ers. And it's right missing. They are setting the tone here early with their work on the boards. Yeah, only a moderate advantage here. Slight move, but as the game wears on, it's one they'll definitely look to build on. There's a minute 47 left here in the opening quarter. Holiday, the pass to Turner. Six on the shot clock. Back to Holiday. 
Over Chalmers. The 76ers with another miss. That's the shot he was looking for. I'm surprised he didn't get it to fall. Wade gets a screen from Anthony. Wade with it, and Young picks him up defensively. You know, the dunk was great, but I didn't care for that interior defense there, guys. It was non-existent. You're right, Clark. You know, it was way too easy. I don't think the coach liked it either. Look at it. Look at that face. Oh. <laughs> it doesn't get much easier than that. They have got to tighten up their defense. That was embarrassing. Holiday dishes to Young. Covered by Anthony. Fires from 14. Shots good from Young. That jump shot's like a layup for him when the defense backs off like that. Wade kicks to Dadier. There's Clutch. He passes to Wade. On deep. Rebound by the 76ers. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Shoots from the high post, and it's right missing. He's laboring out there right now, guys. The shot has not been falling for him this quarter. And Wade slams it in. And check out the bounce. A bounce, bounce to the ounce. Clark, how about that? <laughs> yeah. All right, showing him off right there. Good move. What does that even mean, Kevin? <laughs> bounce to the ounce? <laughs> Now here's Turner. No good on that last second attempt there. So at the end of one quarter of play, still a close game. Lead out front, they lead by a bucket. Let's take a quick break now, and then it's on to the second quarter. After the latest issue of the Sporting News, now in print and digital. Feeds it to Hawks. The turnaround. LeBron grabs the miss. The Heat have gone one of three to start out the second quarter. Heinrich is out there with Bellinelli. Then there's Nick Young. Then there's LaVoy Allen. And it's Hawes in at the five down low. That's the group on the four for Philadelphia. Let's go to our sideline reporter, Doris Burke. Doris, what do you have? Hi, Kevin. Clutch in their last time out against the 76ers played some outstanding basketball. He picked up 18 points and really orchestrated the offense as well as he piled up the assist totals. Another strong showing from him in what has become a habit. All right, Doris, thanks. He was tremendous. Clark, what a performance from a terrific play. And, Kevin, this is what it means when you can be counted on. The kind of game he had is something he wants here tonight. Yeah, it's so special to be able to, to come through under pressure uh, in the biggest of moments, and that's exactly what he did. Flush that thing down, young fella. That is a fierce <laughs> two-hand man. Maximum force on that dunk. They set the screen. Back to Young. The dish to Allen. It's hauled in by LeBron. LeBron's now got rebound number five here tonight. A rebound by Young. The 76ers trail by four. Clark, some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, they need a basket just to regain some momentum here, Kevin. The D might need to body him up a little better next time. Get into him some. Yeah, Clark, they need to be a little bit more physical. Yeah, you can't play this game, Saul. Yeah, but guys, you got to give him some credit for uh, attacking when he had the chance. Chalmers best to LeBron. Brown on him. Drops it in from 11 feet. Eight points for LeBron. Offensively just hammering away in the paint. And that's 10 straight points inside, too. Heinrich outside. Pause. He's guarded by Battier. That shot's good from Hawes. He'd have gone 4 of 7 from the field in the second quarter so far. LeBron outside. Hits off the drop step. LeBron's now got four this quarter. Yeah, when you play against him, Kevin, the first thing you want to address is making it harder on him to go to work down low. If you let him get position inside, it's going to be a long night for you. 
But Steve, we've got to give him credit for his skill as a distributor, too. I mean, he has a great feel for his teammates, and that leads to a lot of his assists and a lot of easy baskets for his team. Young for three. No luck. And the Heat going the other way now. Oh, and a fast break for the Heat. Chalmers running. And he puts it up. And LeBron throws it down. You know, once he corralled that rebound, he was in just the right spot to power it back down. You could see it coming, too, couldn't you? Yeah, I mean, there's no way that was going to be a simple little putback. He saw the angle, and he gave it a little something extra. Heinrich gets to Young. Let's the three fly. That's good. Young's got his first three points of the game. And that's his first three-pointer, so maybe that one will get him started. This is the Battier. Here's Clutch. Five on the clock. There's the feed to Jones. Trying to answer back, but that three is off the mark. Here's Heinrich. The pass to Ivy. Second shot opportunity. Can't get it to go. Some solid defense from Battier. Here's Clutch. The layup missed. You see the defenders get out of his way a lot of times when he's on his way to the bucket, but not that time. Here's Heinrich. The shot is off. Now the Heat take it the other way. Oh, and a fast break for the Heat. Battier with the play. Yeah, he's giving that breakaway rim a workout. Yeah, he, he bowed it down and then hung around. Mm, strong finish. And he just wanted to sit there and savor it for a second. The sprite replay really gave you a good look at the action. High post shot. Offensive rebound. And it's Brown missing. He's always going to have a difficult time finishing when the defense is in his face like that. And finished off by LeBron. Put that paw up there and banged it home. Yeah, Man, little, that was nice. Little Statue of Liberty. Yeah, right. that was strong. Mm, simple, direct, and effective. Young, a screen on Chalmers. Ivy kicks to Hawks. Ivy dishes to Hawks. The 76ers with another miss. The Heat leading by seven. To the paint. Battier, he's covered by Brown. Gets it to go. That's four straight field goals coming inside the paint. Boy, they're taking it right to him, Steve. And the defense has really been way too passive for my liking. Stolen away. Oh, and a fast break for the Heat. Here's Clutch. And he throws it down with one hand. I tell you, you got to love his aggressiveness finishing inside like that. Well, his leaping ability, Clark, gives him a great advantage. And that's why they look to get him the ball around the rim. I mean, it feels like it's either a dunk or a foul and a couple of free throws every possession. Brown with a screen on Chalmers. Just five on the clock. Here's Ivy. And no good. The dry spell continuing for him. The Heat shooting wonderfully up to this point, 67%. Here's Clutch, back to LeBron, up with it, pushes it down. Boy, I tell you what, the D was way too soft right there, like Jello. You gotta do better than that. Clark, he's not the kind of guy you want to get in the way of. No, exactly. He's a hard man to stop coming down the lane, but, but you've got to have good position before the play starts. Al Harrington's checked in for Miami. Young's shot is off. And you can feel the momentum swinging. They needed that shot badly. Steve, I sense some frustration here. It seems like they're getting a little frustrated. It's understandable because they've given up this big run. Here's Clutch, guarded by Wright. That drops. Clutch has got 10 points in the quarter. This is a very steady performance offensively for him. Heinrich passes to Young. Heinrich. 76ers moving the ball around. Brown hits it. Well done in the second effort. They can't seem to stop anybody inside. They got to know that if they don't make life tougher in the paint, the opponent is just going to keep going there. I mean, it's not like they'll get tired of all these in-close opportunities. LeBron gets the hand. And the basket by Harrington. Three straight buckets in the paint. They're making it look effortless. 
Well, speaking of effortless, you'd like to see a little more out of the defense. So how about trying, guys? He dishes it to Young. Heinrich. Brown sets a screen for Heinrich. Heinrich, right side. He hits it from nine. The Heat leading by 13. And here is Chalmers looking for his first bucket of the game. Here's Clutch. They get it back. He hit a three in the first, but so far has been unable to capitalize here in this quarter. And Young kicks to Brown. Young up top. A beautiful reverse layup. Young's got his third bucket of the night. One of the sweetest moves in the game, the reverse layup in traffic. Now Chalmers, right now averaging seven points a game. The turnaround jumper. Here's Clutch. Misses the three. The 76ers trail by 11. Heinrich dishes to Young over Harrington. Brown kicks to Young. Scooped up. And it's Brown missing. And excellent interior defense there. Good rotations. No doubt about it, Steve. He's a real presence inside. Takes up a lot of space. And the basket by Chalmers. Here is Heinrich. Thaddeus Young on the wing. Back to Heinrich. To the inside. Using his post moves to get the two points. Wright's got seven. I'm sure they'd like to get more shots like that. The Heat leading by 11. Here's Jones. There's 45 seconds left in the first half of the game. Six to shoot. Step back shot. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. Brown's got five rebounds tonight. Heinrich gets to Young. Puts it up from 15. Good, and Heinrich gets the assist. Heinrich's got five assists tonight. Guys, some great passing from him. Yeah, it makes it tough for the defense to chase that ball around when it moves that crisply all over the court. Well, it sure does, Clark. And look at the assist totals. They're piling up. I mean, this, is, this has been a, a nice game execution-wise for this club. Here's LeBron, and Philadelphia grabs the miss. Young's got three rebounds so far in the game. These are incredible rebounding numbers. I'm not sure if we've ever seen anything like this, Clark. Uh, that's for sure, Steve. I mean, a superhuman performance on the backboard. Well done. And we've reached halftime in this one. Heat lead by nine. Now, presented by Sprint. Round two of the NBA playoffs is in full swing. This is 2K Sports. An impressive start for the Heat. A win today would be huge. It's the difference between a commanding 3-1 lead or a 2-2 series tie. LeBron James is having himself a big-time performance. High percentage looks in the first half. Amazing work from the field. Shooting in the high 60s. That's big-time bucket buying. On the 76ers side of things, they're managing to hang around. They've been getting roundly outplayed up to this point, and they'll need a bounce-back effort to make up for it in the second half. The first half, a letdown for Drew Holiday. He'll be happy to change baskets, even told his coach the lid was on that side of the court. And that's it for now. Thanks for stopping in with us. It's time to head back to Kevin Harlan, Steve Kerr, Clark Kellogg, and Doris Burke, who are all ready with the call in the second half. And we welcome you back here to the broadcast of the Eastern Conference semifinals. An excellent game we've seen from LeBron. He's got 10 rebounds and 5 assists. He's shown some flash with his passing and some grit with his board work. Well, that's not a combination too many players are capable of either, guys. Here's where Eric Spolster is starting the second half. Clutch in a two-go. LeBron James is out there with Al Harrington. Then there's Dwayne Wade. And it's Allen in at the three side. 
for three points, Harrington. Good. Harrington's got seven points. I tell you, they might have to make a defensive adjustment. They can't give him that kind of a look from beyond the arc. Now here's Turner. He's tightly guarded. Back to right. Pocket six. And it's slammed in by Turner. Are you talking about a power serve? That's how you power that thing down. He went on to the hook, Clark, and didn't disappoint when he got there. No, there's no need to be passive. I mean, you've got to attack. The Heat leading by seven. They set the pick. It's LeBron with the drive. Here's Allen. 11 feet out, and he hits it. Allen's got his second basket. He got that one, but he hasn't been producing the way we're accustomed to. He needs to look for a shot a bit more. Back to Young. And it's Pyam with the jam. Rough and rugged down there in the low post. That's his trademark. Hard rebounds, hard finishes, up high and down hard. And he never stops working. That's what I really appreciate about him, guys. Here's LeBron. Gets it to go. LeBron's now got 19 points. It's been all makes for him so far this half. Three chances and three conversions so far. Holiday goes in. Kicks to Turner. Shoots from 14. Yes, and it's Holiday with the assist that time. Turner's got 11 points. Wade against Holiday. Wade gets a screen from LeBron over Holiday. And there's another one for the Heat. And he's a go-to scorer for a reason. Kevin, he's aggressive. He can adapt to what the defense is doing. You can put your best defender on him. It doesn't matter. Wade will still find ways to get to the basket. Yeah, he's able to make acrobatic finishes and shots that you just can't believe he does. I mean, it takes your breath away, Steve. It's a hard shot, an impossible shot for most players, but for him, it almost seems par for the course. Holiday with it. He feeds it to Turner. Passes to Young. LeBron grabs the miss. A Heat leading by 11. Pass to Wade. Good ball movement here by the Heat. Harrington for three. And the Heat, another three. Now we've seen this from him before. Once he gets going, look out. Now here is Holiday. Bynum with a screen on Wade. Back to Bynum. Off the run. I tell you what, it was the good pick that was set that turned him loose. And once he got around it, Steve, it was smooth sailing right to the hole. Well, because of the pick, he had plenty of room. That's why he was able to power down that slam. Here's Harrington. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. That was not pretty there. You got to make that one, but maybe that's not his range. Holiday, the pass to Young. Turner, he kicks it to right. Bynum inside. And he uses both hands to jam it in. Went for the two-hand throw down there. Needed safety and power. That's, a, that's how you do it. Yep. No, nothing fancy, but he finished with force. Here's Clutch. Turner with the steal. And here we go. Fast break. Turner's got it. Here's Holiday. Turner. Yes, and it's Holiday with the assist that time. Holiday's got his seventh assist here tonight. The Heat leading by eight. Feeds it to Harrington. And that's out of bounds. Miami will retain possession. And some changes here for the Heat. Here's Heinrich, the dish to Young. This is to Bellinelli. Back to Young, uncovered, and again it's Philadelphia. They are closing in here, their offense heating up. Well, you want to maintain contact, and after this nice run here, they've made up some ground, and they're right where they want to be. And there's the feet to Wade. Here's Clutch. He passes it to Chalmers. LeBron, Wade outside, find the shoot. Goes for the alley-oop. Out of bounds. Philadelphia takes possession. Way too loose on that inbounds pass. Evan Turner. He's checked in for Philadelphia. 
Now the 76ers with it. Good momentum. Eight straight points. Heinrich dishes to Turner. On the pass to Bellinelli. He dishes it to Turner. And it's out of bounds. The Heat will take it the other way. The Heat leading by six. Here's Clutch. Barry is the easy one. Clutch has got 19 points. You know, if their plan was to keep going inside a ton, it sure has paid off. I mean, it seems like every bucket they get is in the lane. Well, no reason to take an outside shot if you're scoring at will from inside the paint. Poked loose. And here is Chalmers. LeBron with it. Picked up by Turner. And that one's good. And it's a 10-point heat lead. By shooting percentage is off the charts, guys. He's really hitting his shots today. There's the pick. Heinrich kicks to Hawes. Good, and Heinrich gets the assist. Heinrich's got his seventh assist in the game. They continue to barrel their way inside, and when's the defense going to adjust? Well, I'm asking the same question myself, partner. I mean, that's eight points out of their last ten coming inside. Here's Clutch. Turner covering. Kicks it to Harrington. From downtown, it's held in by Spencer Hawkins. Boy, but he was close, Kevin, to making the defense pay for lackadaisical coverage there. Yeah, he had a really good look. I mean, he'll knock that down more often than not. He may single-handedly bring his team back, guys. What a fantastic quarter he's had. Here's Clutch. Turner covering. That's good. Clutch has got six points in the quarter. You know, it's really the kind of game you expect from him, guys. I mean, extremely efficient. Taking a lot of good shots. Now Heinrich. Back to Allen. He feeds it to Bellinelli. And the 76ers tack on two more. And the pace has really ramped up in the second half. Steve, I like the re-energized effort here. I mean, it's been a battle. Passes it to Chalmers. With the lead pass. Looking for Harrington, and he gets it there. And the running layup is good. Harrington's got 12 points in the game. Wow, has he caught fire this quarter, shooting the ball with tremendous confidence. Back to Allen. Heinrich outside. Bellinelli up top. Down low. Allen. Gets it to go. And the Heat all time here. Yeah, guys, I think he feels like he can make a few improvements during this timeout. Just kind of make a couple of adjustments, get his club back on track. You know, coaches are always tweaking and tinkering with things mid-game. Actually, sometimes they overdo it. Andrew Bynum's checked in for Spencer Hawkins. Shot clock at six. Back to LeBron. Over Bynum. And the Heat get another bucket right there. You know, he's having a special quarter. 100% field goal shooting. They need to continue to ride it and work to get him good shots. Allen left side. Goes up. There's the bucket. Good. Allen's got six points. That's right where they wanted to go with the ball on that possession. Here's Clutch. Pass to Wade. LeBron up top. Back to Wade. It's blocked. This game very well could come down to a few possessions, and if that's the case, rebounding could play large. Yeah, in a close game like this one, securing the ball is so vital. And that one's good. Now it's just a three-point heat lead. What a finish with that hoop. Oh, took the contact and tried to throw it down over the top. But instead, he'll shoot free throws. Nice numbers from D-Wade. He has 14 points and the one steal. I think his energy and intensity offensively and defensively has been sensational. He had an extremely well-rounded performance, Clark. Here's what Philadelphia's going with right now. 
Thaddeus Young. He's checked in for LaVoy Allen. And Terrell Wright has subbed in for Bellinelli. And Miami with a change here, too. Allen's checked in and blocked. They retain possession. The Heat leading by five. Wade, right side. Here's Clutch. Line him with the steal. And a two-for-one opportunity. Yeah, they've got to hurry. Step on the gas here. Covered by LeBron. Young passes to right. Young sets a screen for right. Shot clock at five. Takes a three. And that one's good. White's got ten. Here's Wade. He's got 16. And the powerful one-handed slam. The one-handed flush. Very nice. Yeah, nice strong finish there. Mm, just punched it home. Here's Heinrich. LeBron with the block. The third quarter comes to a close. It's the Heat up by four. And we'll be back right after this. Welcome back as we get ready to start the fourth quarter. Who's at the Sprite uncontainable game in this one? Well, let's send it out to our Doris Burke. Doris? Kev, as you might have guessed, the uncontainable game today goes to the Miami Heat. It's been one of those games for them where they've got all the breaks and all the rolls. I'm sure they won't complain about it, though. Thanks again. The 76ers trail by four. Pairing up in the backcourt, Drew Holiday and Evan Turner. Drell Wright is out there with Young, and it's Bynum, and at the five, Roman the paint. That's the group on the four for Philadelphia. And it's going to be two free throws. Drew contact on the shot. Well, you allow them to get right to the rim like that. That's your only option. Yeah, I think you got to foul them, and free throws are better than a layup. The Heat making a switch here. Harrington's checked in. Both shots good from the strike. A few possessions into the fourth quarter, just over a minute played. Here's Clutch. He kicks to Wade. Harrington with a screen on Hubbard. But drive by Wade. Pop throws off the pick and hammers it home. Tell you what, it has been all offense all game long. You know what? This is really fun to watch, guys. I mean, as a coach, though, this is when you want to just harness this energy and bottle it up and ride it all the way. They've raised their field goal percentage just above 50% here. They actually look like a totally different team than what we saw in the first half. Much better execution offensively. Solid play in the low block, and that one's good. Wade's got four points this quarter. The 76ers trail by four. And Holiday gets to right. Thaddeus Young on the wing. Young, right side. Holiday. And it's D. Wade with the rebound. Wade's got his third rebound tonight. Here's the screen. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. Turner's got his third rebound on the night. Outside Holiday. Feeds to Turner. Plenty of space. Buries the jump shot. Turner's got 21 in the game. Well, it's been a tale of two halves, hasn't it, guys? After a terrible first half, he's really picking it up. Harrington kicks to LeBron. Out to Wade. A baseline J. Good, and the assist goes to LeBron. LeBron's now got six assists in the game. 76ers have gone three or four in field goal attempts since getting things started here in the fourth. Young outside. Back to Holiday. Turner. Here's the floater. Now he was right there, but the defensive pressure forced that miss. Well contested. That really made it a tough shot. Here's Wade. And a serious dunk to finish it off. He power surged that one down. Mm, wow. Yeah, good turn to use. One of the game's top dunkers for sure. Oh, no question. And he loves to attack the rim, doesn't he? Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We've got about three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth quarter. Lineham dishes to right. The jump hook. Now Harrington grabs the board. Harrington's got his fourth rebound in this one. Dishes it to Allen. Here's the dish to Harrington. 
It's hauled in by the 76ers. White's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. They really want to find that igniter here. Yeah, that's right. The, Kevin, the offense has basically been running in place. They got to get going. Holiday gets the bucket. The Heat leading by four. There's Clutch. Back to LeBron. Harrington. The three is launched. Harrington can't get that one to fall. Boy, but he was close, Kevin, to making the defense pay for lackadaisical coverage there. Yeah, he had a really good look. I mean, he'll knock that down more often than not. But he need have gone 5 of 8 shooting as we've come down the home stretch in this final quarter. Back to Wade. Fires from the line. That is good. Wade's got 16 here in the second half. And the 76ers call time here. D. Wade really playing well in this one. He's on fire. They needed to put their heads together to figure out how to get the ball out of his hand. Let's catch up with Doris from the sideline. Thank you, Kevin. I got a chance to hear what Doug Collins was saying to the team. He told the squad, now is the time when we turn it on and leave them in the rear view mirror. It won't be easy, but guys, I know we can put them away. Let's see if they can deliver, Kevin. Guarded by Holiday. Here's Clutch. Six on the shot clock. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. A little added hang time right there. Yeah, letting himself down easy, it looks like. Soft landing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a little better for the knees, so I don't blame him. And the highlight real replay. Brought to you by Sprite. Good stuff. Holiday off a pick from Young. Holiday with it. Wade picks him up. Holiday against Wade. Here's Young. And it's Bynum with the jam. Well, he leading by four. Now the feed to Harrington. There's the pick. And the shot is good. Harrington's got ten points here in the second half. He's starting to pick up his game in this half. Holiday, the pass to right. And there's the pass to Young. It's stolen by Harrington. And here we go. Fast break. Wade's got it. Here's LeBron. Gets it to go. And it's an eight-point heat lead. They're just getting better offensively as the game goes along, making good choices and getting high-percentage shots. And they're playing hard and playing smart, too, Steve. Um, they've just been very, very good. Right from outside, another three for Philadelphia. You know, you ask around the league, and they'll tell you the same thing. Darrell Wright loves to set up shop in the corner. It's the closest of the three-point shots around the arc. And Wright takes advantage. He gets locked and loaded as soon as he catches the ball in that corner. It's just automatic. Yeah, he's made a name for himself around the league with his ability to shoot. And a lot of that is because he is so effective when he gets a look from the baseline. That is good. Great action. Back-to-back three-pointers at either end. Sort of an anything you can do, I can do better situation going on right here, guys. A three. And that one's good. White's got eight points here in this quarter. Well, that's a quality look there. The defense a bit late. And two straight now from long range. Putting up points in a hurry, Clark. Here's Clutch. Six to shoot. Quick move inside. And then ten is done. Well, you've got to do a better job defensively. You know this player has a ton of scoring ability. The 76ers trail by eight. And Holiday hits to Young. He passes to Turner. Fires the three. The shot misses. And Miami the other way now. On the wing, Dwayne Wade. Over right. That's good from Wade on the assist by LeBron. 30 points for Wade. He's done an outstanding job all game long. Absolutely a great job of finding an opening against the defense. 
Now here's Turner. Tight defense on him. Here's Young. And it's D. Wade with the rebound. Wade's got rebound number five here tonight. Here's Clutch. He dishes it to Harrington. There's the triple. That is Young grabs the miss. The well, 76ers have got a pretty good rhythm going offensively, shooting 8 of 15 for the quarter. Outside Holiday. Drains the J off the nimble drop step. That's one of the toughest shots in basketball, Kevin. It's so tricky to get the soft touch and the accuracy when you're flying to the basket. Kicks it to LeBron. Inside, here's Wade. Back to LeBron. Takes it up. He feeds it to Harrington. Fires for three. Good, and the assist goes to LeBron. LeBron's now got his eighth assist here tonight. You know, with their lead and the success they're having from behind the three-point arc, there's no reason to get away from it. Stay with them. Heat check. I mean, just find out if you're hot. Once they're going, keep firing. And Young with the stop. He spoke loud on making a statement that play. Yeah, that was brute force battling for the offensive board then taking it right back up there. Mm, that's just all about strength and energy, you guys. Here's Clutch. Oh! <laughs> Went to the windmill dunk to turn this place on its ear. I love it. Yeah, this crowd is stunned. Man, they should be, Kevin. That was one elaborate finish. Bynum, this is the holiday. Some nice ball movement here by the 76. That one goes. Come. White's got 14 points here in the second half. All of those three pointers coming off his fingers have been right on the money. Harrington defended by Young. There's 154 left in the fourth quarter of this one. Here's Clutch. Shot clock at six. This is it the way. Over Holiday. And another basket for Miami. My goodness, he's going off in this fourth. He's got the guys on the bench going crazy. Rally towels and all. 139 left in the fourth quarter. It's stolen by Wade. Oh, and a fast break for the Heat. Wade with the ball. Pass to Harrington. Takes it right up. Up and in on the way. And it's a 12-point Heat lead. 124 left in the game. He kicks it to Bynum. Covered by LeBron. The jump hook. Shot is off. And the Heat going the other way now. Here's Clutch. Feeds to Harrington. From deep. Andrew Bynum grabs the miss. Kevin, I didn't like that defensive effort at all, but they're lucky he missed it. Yeah, they were uh, very lucky defensively because there was some miscommunication there. They left him wide open. Nice soft touch to drop that one in. There's 49 seconds left in the fourth quarter. the alley pass and then Wade slams it in I think we can chalk this one up the goal now is just to run some time yeah I think it's time to get the bus started now boys Philadelphia's gone past the three-point line for 13 of their shots They're six of 13 Bynum the pass to Holiday Bynum sets a screen for Holiday here's Young it's good the assist that time from Holiday now, they probably needed more of this earlier, guys. I don't think there's enough time left to get back into the game. Guys, this is really a case of, of too little too late, but at least it gives them something to work off of going into the next game. There's 14 seconds left to play here in the fourth, and the officials signal the backcourt violation. Not very careful there. And so it's Miami winning this one. They came, they saw, they conquered. Hey, Kevin, to me, any win is a good win. Time for us to say so long. Thanks for watching our coverage of the second round of the NBA playoffs. For Steve Kerr, Clark Kellogg, Doris Burke, and the rest of our 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying so long.
as we present the Jordan player of the game. You had 10 assists tonight. Any perspective on how you led the way with your assists? Um, yeah, I was just playing within myself and following the flow of the offense. I know that my guys will be running their behinds off trying to get open, and it's my job to keep my head up and hit them when they get some space. So really, all the credit should go to them for how tirelessly they worked to create the chances that they did. For me, it was just more of holding onto the ball long enough for them to do their thing.